More than 7,000 nurses off the job and on the picket line for the third straight day. Today comes with optimism as both Mount Sinai and Montefiore Bronx are back at the negotiating table. And we're really close. We want to go back in. We didn't even want to be out here. And at this point, what's holding us up is that we want to make sure that our emergency, department, our emergency departments are therapeutic environments for our patients that are safe that are hygienic. Montefiore said their counter offer includes increasing the nursing staff by 150, establishing what they call average nurse to patient ratios with enhanced staffing enforcement and a promise to eliminate hallway patients. Montefiore has said to us that they agree they'd like to fix these things, but that we have to find them the money. But the New York State Nurses Association says there is more pushback from Mount Sinai. Today, the CNO of Mount Sinai had the nerve to say that ratios are too rigid. Somebody should ask her what that means. Sounds like you're not even close at Mount Sinai. Mount Sinai made that decision. Until they can strike a deal, these nurses vow to remain outside, unpaid, with the support of their fellow union brothers and sisters. There are funds being raised for a strike fund for us from union members all over the state. I told them I hope we won't need it because we really want to go back in.